Hi guys, it's Stacy. I'm back to sh do a share of another little notebook journal that I've made using um, Ellie's uh, kit. Uh, her shop is called Elsie Bell's Bookshelf and the kit was called uh, Nature's Music. And if you saw my video the other day, I had two TNs. The other one has since gone to its new home, but this one was still available. And I used the same paper collection with this. So the kit had a regular size and it had the traveler's notebook size. So this one I used the regular size, of course. This is eight and a half by uh, five and a half. So this is the same paper collection. This paper is so pretty, I love it. And this was a piece from the kit. So this one I've uh, I've drew drew out a little bit more of the green out of the paper. So here's some little pretty little pearls, lots of little cr crinkle ribbon. And this one has a book plate on it. It just felt more like a notebook, so I, I needed a a little label on the front there. You can it's got some vintage paper behind there, so you can write on what you would like it to do say or and then of course it's reinforced with cotton fabric. Inside here we have a nice big pocket. In the front I've included a little library pocket with a card. Um, here's a piece from the paper collection. This is all Prima paper. And then here is one of Ellie's little tags from that match the uh, nature's music kit and there's one of the pages it's gorgeous i've printed everything on 32 pound paper it's very smooth to write on i've added some trims here's another one of her little tags this paper collection is gorgeous it has um, a gold boiling through it i've added some of my washi stash here's another page from her kit uh, i've just added believe in yourself on a this blank page here with this blank music paper. It's gorgeous. Um, here's one of the paper bag tags I make. Decided to add some of the pieces and just sort of uh, add that in there. I love making those. Here's a nice big die cut of a rose. You can write on the back or you can stick it down somewhere. Here's one of her pages. It's a little piece from the, the paper collection some coffee paper. This is one of her, um, her, it's like a journaling card, but what I've done is I've just printed it on sticker paper. I mentioned that in the other video and then I've just stuck it down there. I've added another label here just to bring out a little bit more of the green. Nice line pages. All her pages are backed with the line background pages. Got some vellum. There's another one of her pretty little tags. Here's, these are, this pink paper is my Dilusions stained paper. This here is also one of, her, is in her shop. She has these pretty labels and I'll, I'll link that so that you can find those. And I've just printed it on sticker paper as well. And I just kind of just tore it just to make, add some interest there. This is a vintage date do sticker. Um, here I've just um, used my really pretty Dilusions cutoffs and I just made a little notepad there, just for extras. Note taking or journaling, this is vintage paper. Here I've uh, just made a little tuck spot sewn here. This is a, a very old air mail envelope. This is an old pattern book that I had and that was a page from it. It's just a little journaling tag. On the back here is another little tuck spot, just on a little collage with um, some extra flowers. This is a little paper clip with a butterfly. And then this is just some note card. And then this is a sticker. This was from her Nature's Music kit as well. And then I just tuck that in there. Um, this is from the kit. I've just fussy cut that out. It is on sticker paper, so you can stick it down anywhere you like. And this is uh, vintage ledger paper. Here I've just added a little cluster of little bits that you could write a note card or do some journaling, and this is from the kit. This is also one of her tags. I've done a little bit of sewing on some of the pages, just a note card. This is some little tickets from the kit. A nice space for journaling. It's got a... Uh, um, 
you know, it's got it's from the paper pad, but it's easily written over, or you can collage it as a background. I have added some blank chipping tags. This is a little bag that I've turned into a tuck spot. This is one of her labels, and these are all her little pieces from the kit. Postcard. I didn't alter everything too much in here. Just it kind of when I say notebook, I kind of just kind of do your own thing with this one. There's just lots of bits to play with. So I've ad I've added, you know, another sticker here. Here's another blank little card, and here's a little piece from the kit or the paper pad. And there's a vintage Rolodex card. And I've just stitched a little pocket here. Here's some fabric, and this just comes out. This was uh, a sticker stuck down here. This was uh, I had printed on sticker paper as well. So nice copy paper. Here's a little. This guy turns on the vintage paper. Another journaling card. This page just flips. Okay, here I've done a, another collage here. This one's from the, the kit, um, the journal kit. This is paper, this is one of the cards from the, the Prima. And then this is also one of hers, one of those labels that I was talking about. Um, I've just stuck another one there and just done a little collage with some trim. Nice background page. That's so pretty. It's got It's got the gold foiling in there as well and here's a nice big postcard from her from her kit as well and I've just added a little some little labels and there's one of her tickets this is from the kit nice big journaling card it's one with little pearl this is from the kit Nice line pages. This one's from the kit as well. And here I've added a photo pocket. And with a big journaling card, I've added Say Hello to a New Day. I've just added some bits under here. Just some extra little things I had. A stitched pocket there. This is the same paper as this one here I used on the front cover and this one I used inside so, yeah so I've included another photo pocket to use and then this was an extra piece I've just turned that into like a little journaling card or postcard so that's that one so thanks again for watching and I will link at least shot below where you can find out this see the same kit you can get it in the TN size or the regular notebook size okay guys take care and we'll be back soon